Hi, St. Basil's, Father Ryan Mann here, and I'm in the Polaris four-wheeler of the maintenance department. I saw our maintenance guy, Chuck, get out of it, and I had to hop in for this week's video. But this week, I got to meet with another group for the first time, the Parish Council. And the Parish Council are the eyes and ears of the parish. They help pastors, or me, the administrator, know what's going on, and they help advise me so that I can make sure all of our plans are the best way to help all of you meet and grow in Jesus Christ. A great meeting, and I heard all of them share what they love about the parish. And it was almost unanimous that what they love is the community. All of you. The people are kind and joyful, they're supportive, and there's numerous ways to get involved here, whether it's being nourished on scripture or serving others. People seem to really enjoy that St. Basil's is alive. And that's more than just one person. That's all of you being involved. So I just want to say it again. Thanks for making this parish so wonderful that as I've been here only about six weeks now, I continue to hear how great it is. This Sunday, we're going to hear in the gospel one of Jesus's famous parables about what is fair, what is not fair. And really what he's getting at is that God's love, God's relationship is a gift. We can't earn it. We're not owed it. It's freely out of his generosity, but he's eager to offer each one of us this gift. And if we start relating to God like a boss, like he owes us something or we have rights, we miss out on the most beautiful truth that everything God does is purely out of his kindness and generosity. He's not, he doesn't owe us anything. And at first that can seem a little strange, but the more we sit with it, we realize the fact that we have breath, the fact that there's a sunrise and sunset, Friends, family, technology, all of these gifts come from him being moved by love and not him owing us anything. I look forward to seeing you this weekend. Once again, don't forget to share these videos and invite people, if they're not ready to come back to Mass, to watch the live stream at 9 a.m. God bless, and I'll see you soon.